Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm filming a plan with me in my Erin Condren horizontal planner. So I am going to be filming another plan with me in the um, Per Impression Coil B6 planner, but um, I wanted to film one in the horizontal just to show y'all how cute they turn out. So this is the current week. It's Saturday today and look how pretty that is. Um, yes, I have not filled my meals for the week or um, done my habit trackers but I have been doing all of these I just haven't checked them off but anyway so yeah this is the current week and this is um, a kit that is still currently in the shop it's called pastel wonderland and I just love how it turned out so um, a few of you have asked me why are the boxes like not the width of the actual um, week here and that is because well this is an old format but I hadn't realized that the new um, 2020 to 2021 horizontal layout they actually widened the boxes here so I did reformat um, my kits to fit those so any kits going forward are reformatted to fit perfectly in these boxes. If you have any of my older horizontal kits, you are going to have a tiny little gap like here. It doesn't look bad, but I know it does um, bug me. But anyway, just thought I would let y'all know that. And um, this week I'm going to be using the Rustic Christmas Kit. This was a huge, huge, huge favorite this month. I'm really happy y'all loved it. Um, it's one of my favorites as well. So my horizontal kits come with three sheets. So you get the full boxes, like the functional with some deco and date covers, and then the washi strips, which I'm gonna show you how I use them, and then some other functional boxes. So a few of you asked how um, the washi fits, and I will let you all know that these kits were designed to fit the Erin Condren because of the rounded boxes. So if you have any other horizontal that's not an Erin Condren, the washi strips may look a little weird if you lay them down. So just thought I would let you all know that. But anyway, let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do is put down these little washi strips. And the way... Here, let me zoom in a little. Oh yeah, by the way, I found my camera. So I was super happy about that. Anyway... So the way I designed the um, washi strips is for them to go right above um, the date. So just line it up there and it's going to go perfectly to that line right there. So that's how I formatted these. You can use them any other way you'd like, but this is just how I designed it because this is the way that I use them. So I know some people have been confused as to like how to use these, but... Yeah, that's how um, I designed them to be used. Also, this kit does not come with like any other washi to use up here at the top. But I know that most of us have washi, so that's another reason why I didn't like include top washi or bottom washi. Because it's always good to use your stash if you're not like, you know, a hoarder or a collector of washi. I ended up selling most of mine, which like I said in the last video, I kind of regret now. I don't even think I have any washi that matches this kit, so I don't even know if I'm going to be using any washi at the top because here, let me show you. I like adding washi to my weeks, like up here at the top and here at the bottom. I like doing that with every week, you can see there, so I don't know, we'll figure it out. Hopefully I find something that won't look too bad with it. If not, then that's fine. I'll just use deco to decorate. So yeah, anyway, it's Saturday today. I just got back from dropping off the very last batch of orders I had. I had to go to the two different post offices because the first one I went to, the mail drop box was so full. Um, I could only fit 10 orders in there, so I had to drive another 30 minutes to drop off the rest of the orders. But anyway, okay, so that washi is done, and then the next thing I want to do is the, um, the date covers. So also, the date covers on the new um, layouts... On the new kit layouts yeah whatever are different so you can see the old layouts they were scalloped and then the days of the weeks were 
I'm designed this way but now I designed them to go vertically I know I had a few um, customers request that so that's another change I made and they are no longer scalloped they're um, thinner and um, they're squared off so they are still made to fit right under here so as you can see I don't know if you can see they are rounded off still so let me show you so all you have to do is just line it up right under there and then it's gonna fit perfectly there well I mean this one's crooked but yeah that's how I designed those to fit there I really love like the new format um, I had a few people say that they didn't really use like the ombre boxes like these right here so I ended up reformatting this sheet to include a few more like functional boxes instead of having like a whole sheet of like ombre boxes but anyway yeah like I was saying um, thankfully the second post office like the bins weren't full but there was a huge line I had to wait like close to 10 minutes just to um to get to the bins to drop off my orders so I am at zero open orders now that always feels so good I think I only have hey excuse Winston rude anyway um I forgot what I was saying Oh yeah, I think I only have like three open orders um, that came in this morning that I need to work on, but I can work on those later today. Winston, quiet. This dog, I'm telling y'all, he drives me crazy. He barks at any little sound he hears. Okay, so, and I also just realized that these two are the same color. How did I never notice that? I've had this kit for like a month. And that really bothers me but oh well I'm gonna have to leave it that way so the next thing I will do is put down the full boxes um, so here's this one I like to keep track of my meals so this one's gonna go down here oh you know what it's There you go. Fits perfectly. Um, so let's see. What boxes am I going to use? So the two gnomes I want on opposite sides. So let's do this. Let's put this one here. Can y'all see? I'm so out of frame. Let's do this. I still need to get a hang of it. Um, there you go. Then we'll put the other gnome on this side right here. So let's use, oh, you know what? I forgot to put the date dots down. Let's do that because then I won't know what day is what. Also, if you celebrate Christmas, what are your plans? Um, we're just gonna drive out to California to drop off presents. Um, my side of the family like they all have plans so i'm not really gonna get to see them um, i haven't seen them all year which kind of sucks but um you know we're trying to stay safe and stuff i know they're they've been um super careful and thankfully no one in my family has caught the virus except for my dad but i don't really talk to him but um, he's okay. Um, but besides him, like the rest of my family has been fine. So I really wanted to spend a little time with them, but they're being super, like, you know, paranoid. Not par paranoid, it's not the right word because I know it's always scary. Um, it's a scary thing to, to get the virus. So. I'm just gonna drive out there, call him up, and just drop off gifts. That's all we're gonna do. And that's pretty much all of our plans. Um, what are you guys doing? Are you guys visiting family? I know. All right, so I said I was gonna use this gnome one up here. Let 
there and then so the 24th I'll put the tree on the 25th That path. 25th, and then let's do the snowman here. So, are you guys done Christmas shopping? I'm not. I still have a few more people to shop for. Every year, I always wait till the last minute. And I did most of my Christmas shopping, like online and stuff. Um, but I'm still missing like a few family members that, I don't know, I need to go shopping for. And I'm dreading that. So I was all ready to go to Target today, but I left my house, went to Duncan, and when I got to the post office, I realized I didn't bring my mask with me because it didn't take my purse. I just grabbed my my wallet planner and drove off. So I was like, dang it. So I couldn't even go to Target because the nearest Target to my house is like a 20 minute drive and I just really did not feel like driving all the way back home to grab the mask and then drive all the way back to go to Target. So. Mm. I did also go to Duncan. How to get my coffee. So tomorrow is the day that my hubby takes off from doing shipped. So we'll just go do the rest of our Christmas shopping tomorrow. So okay, there are the boxes. Now this is one I usually put down the washi. Dang it, and I don't have any that matches. It really bugs me. I suppose I can use... Mm, I have this like metallic gold which I, it does match I'll just go with that one because I don't have any other washi that'll fit these are not the right shades that's a bummer I'll just go with this one um, it's from simply gilded so I'm just gonna run some down here and some at the top and I'm just gonna fast forward this part so y'all don't get bored. Okay, and that is where we're at with the kit so far. I really love using the washi like I mentioned earlier. So I think I'm going to add another one here. What do y'all think? Yeah, I'm going to add another piece of washi tape up here. And my camera's going to shut off. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I had to shut off the camera and... And turn it back on because every 20 minutes it like shuts off automatically. Don't know why. I think it's so that it doesn't overheat or something. I don't know. But yeah, anyway. There's that. Ooh. Okay. So... There's that. Now, let's see. Then, this is really crooked. So down here, like in between this washi, is where I put the, um, like my habit trackers. So, I use all three. Let's put those down. Also, are any of you still playing, um, get my keyboard out of the way. Do any of you, um, play, um, Animal Crossing? I know that was, like, super popular when it came out. Um, I won't lie, I was, like, hooked on it as well. But I haven't played in a while. I did kind of get back into it, um, 
with the whole winter release and I love it. If any of you play, um, let me know. Um, send me your your friend friend codes. Is that what they're called? So I can add y'all because I need more friends that play. All of my friends just stopped playing it. So it's kind of boring if I'm like the only one that plays. So I would love to add more people on there. Okay, so there's that. Next thing is the weekend banner, which I'll just put down here. It looks really cute. And then now let's plan day by day. So we're gonna head out. Let's see on Monday. Let's let me just start with Monday so I don't like confuse myself. And you know what I should have done, which I told myself, prepare yourself, have all your stickers out and ready to go. But did I do that? No, I did not. So anyway, let's just wing it. Um, so Monday is $2, not $2 Tuesday, what am I saying? It's um, mini kit Monday. So for that, I'm going to be using one of these labels to write it down there. And let's write down not $2 Tuesday. Why am I saying $2 Tuesday? Mini Kit Monday. And I want to put down a cute sticker. So yeah, I had these Mini Kit Mondays. If y'all don't know what they are, um, I started this Mini Kit Monday thing back in 2016 and they were really popular. It's All it is is like a full page like a let me show you it's like a five by seven sheet um mini kit so it comes with date covers functional stickers um um full boxes washi so i'm going to be using this cute sticker from bubba bear studios so i'll just put it there but yeah it's like a one page mini kit and they are each three dollars and i usually come out with like four different designs so that's the special for that day so um if you don't follow me on instagram i did mention that i'm gonna be doing mini kit mondays and two dollar tuesdays like every other week so this week on tuesday i had a um two dollar tuesday deal with a really pretty like valentine's day kit but it's in these really soft pastel yellow and pink colors and of course i don't have the full boxes but um and this color scheme it was really popular i'm really glad um you all loved it but here let me show you a deco sheet so you can kind of get an idea so that's the art for what was on sale and then with that it's some um, like watercolor swatch um stickers on clear matte paper so that's that was the deal this week it's still up in the shop i didn't take it down um, which I need to do. I said I was going to do that on Friday and I totally forgot. So anyway, yeah. So this coming week is going to be Mini Kit Monday on the on Monday. And then um, I know that day I'm going to have to go drop off some orders. And for that, um, let's see. I'm not sure if I should use... I'm just going to put down the sticker like that. So this is another sticker from Boba Bear Studios. Cute little male person. That. And then I'm going to use one of these custom stickers that I'm going to be offering in the shop starting um, tomorrow, Sunday. So you have the option of um, choosing the clear matte paper or just my standard premium matte with whatever word or words you like. So I think that font is so cute. So I'm going to be offering four different fonts. Um, so I think that's pretty fun. So PO drop off for the a few orders that I have to fill today and whatever other orders come in this weekend. And then... Um, Monday. I know I had other stuff to do. 
Hmm. I think that's it. And then for Tuesday, I'm going to put down a checklist. And that's crooked. Um, and this was an oopsie because it cut it out as like a little rectangle when it was supposed to cut around the word. So I just kept that sheet. Oh my gosh. Let me just cut some of the excess off of it. I promise I will be better prepared on my next plan with me. So what I used to do back in the day when I was filming like weekly plan with me's, I used to pull out all of the um all of the stickers that I was going to use for the week and set them aside. That way I didn't have to go looking through my um, sticker albums to find the sticker I wanted to use. That saves a lot of time, so note to self. I'm going to make sure I do that next time. So to do, and then um, I'm going to put down just like a full box here. And then that. I'm going to use one of these little alarm clocks from Taylor and Tucker. So let's use this yellow one to mark down that I need to wake up early. Okay, so since we are going to be traveling, we're going to be gone two days. I need to make sure that I clean Spooky's litter boxes and that I fill his water bowls and food bowl. I think he'll be fine. We've left him alone for a couple of days before and he was fine. He like doesn't miss us at all. He pretty much sleeps all day. But we do have um, cameras inside the house that we're going to leave on just to make sure that he's okay and um, talk to him every once in a while. So for Wednesday, since we're going to be driving, I don't know what that sticker's from, but that's funny. Okay, so I'm going to be using one of these roll chip stickers from my shop, um, and let's use the, just like, cream colored one. Um, and that's pretty much that and then I do need to drop off the presents to my family. So let's just use one of these um. Drop off gifts There it is and then I forgot for Monday I do have an Amazon delivery coming um, I had to order um, like a hammock type thing for the back of the car for the dogs because this is the first road trip we're taking um, with Winston and he doesn't do well in cars so I'm really hoping he doesn't make a big mess but this hammock thing um, it's like waterproof and it pretty much covers the entire back seat. It covers the entire back seat and it's like a big hammock so um, they can't like jump around and stuff. So I'm just writing to set it up in the car. Um, hopefully that helps. So anyway, for Tuesday, um, let me just write down the few things that I do need to do. See, I'm all over the place. Like, I already planned Wednesday, but then now I'm going back to Tuesday when I should have done that before. There's that, and then for Thursday the 24th, since these, so, let me zoom out. So since I don't know what we're going to be doing exactly for the 24th or the 25th, I'm going to leave those blank. But then I know for Saturday, we're going to head back home early in the morning. So let's use this one here. Um, 
head back home um, and then that's gonna be like a four hour drive and then I do want to get the laundry done that day so let me just use one of these full boxes right here okay so I'm just gonna be using one of these laundry stickers couldn't find one with Pookie Bear so just put that there and then Sunday is gonna be a chill day so that day I'm also just going to leave it blank um, it is gonna be like a cleaning day so let's use a half box there and then clean house and to clean the house, I'm going to use the sticker from Nana Sticky Stickers. It's one of my go-to shops. Even though the pink kind of clashes, it's a super cute sticker. So there's that. And then Friday is Andrew's shipped pay day. So let's use this little scallop sticker here. You know what? That's a holiday, so I'm pretty sure he's going to be getting paid on the 24th. So let's just put it here. And then I'm going to use one of these little script stickers from my shop. In there. And then I'm pretty sure for Sunday, um, I'm going to be filming any other plan with me. So let me just use this one and then I'm going to use a mini YouTube sticker from my shop. So I'll just put this here. YouTube and film. Film, edit, and then upload. Since it didn't fit, I'll just write it there. That's fine. I'm going to use the little Pookie Bear drinking a, a nice coffee for this day. Since we're heading out, we need to get some coffee because it's going to be a long drive. I'm not driving. My husband is, but still. Okay, and then I totally forgot for Monday is when I'm mailing my sister's package out um yeah i don't think i'm gonna put a sticker down i'm just gonna put this here so this is a mini sheet from grumpy bear sticker co i think she changed her shop name to bear necessities i'm not too sure i think it's bear necessities co i don't know but um i'll link her shop down below so um this package I can't forget that okay so there is that and you know what I think that is it um, I do need to write down this okay so here is a finished week so these two days since I don't know what we're gonna be doing I will just fill those out when we come back home on Saturday but yeah, um, I really hope you all enjoyed my video. I know it's a hot mess, y'all. I really need to get back into my groove. Um, next video, I'm going to make sure that I have all of the stickers I'm using like pulled out because going through all of the sticker albums really um, is time consuming. But anyway, I'll be better prepared next time. But if you all enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Um... Yeah, I hope you all have a very Merry Christmas if you do celebrate Christmas. Um, if not, I hope you all have a great week. And I will talk to you all next week when I um, upload another Plan With Me video. Alright, bye y'all.